How's my quad squad doing everybody? It's the man, the myth, the legend, Quad MFT here, and today is Sunday, aka Father Sunday, with my dad on. What up, dude? Hey, what is up, Warriors? It's the Quad Father here, and it's a good thing we're talking about Warriors, because tomorrow... We're talking about the men who created freedom within our oh, country. Oh, that's why we have the yeah. day off. Sorry, yeah. I kind of get used to, you know, <laughs> that's oh, tomorrow. yes, we have a four-day weekend. I know a lot of people don't have four-day weekends this weekend, but yeah. I do. It's just because, like, my school district has that, but well, no, I'm Valentine's not going to complain. I'm not, I, I heard a, a school district near me, Orville, which is, like, about an hour away, actually has a, this whole week off. For what? Why I have they get no that? idea. That's all I heard. It could maybe, be a complete lie. That's just what I've heard. Maybe they're celebrating all of the presidents. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Every single, we're 50 yes. days off. Yeah. <laughs> 52 days. 50? Oh, 50? Uh, 50. I, 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 I don't know. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Well, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> they're, they're only getting seven days off, so yeah, it doesn't really matter. Either way, I'll just take a bunch of days off. But today, I wanted to kind of talk about something that is not necessarily happening to me, but it, it kind of... It's on my mind a lot. It's money and youth. And young money. money. Yeah, young money, <laughs> cush money, little Wayne, 420. But You know, actually, the, one of the reasons this came up is uh, because we, I was hanging out with my buddy this week, and who has uh -huh. lots of money. Yes, lots okay? of And he has kids, mm -hmm. and kids about your age. Yep. And I was talking to him about what would, you know, how, how set are your kids financially? Because, you know, they, they're getting ready to go into college. Mm -hmm. How important is it for you to, you know, because you, if you just gave all your money to them, they could they'd live. Be, oh, they'd they be set live, for life. They, yeah. could, they could live. And he says, I don't think it's good for, for kids. Matter of fact, if my wife and I both died, mm -hmm. they would get some money for college and money for a house, and all the rest of my money, millions, would be donated. That's and that just boggled my mind. And I know, so, like, uh, I. What, what do you if, think? I, I, I don't know what I would do if you were a millionaire and you left me off like that. Like, I don't mean left me, but like, that was what I was getting. I, I don't know if I would feel upset. Like, we're not rich. If we were really rich, do you think you'd buy me a lot of stuff or would you kind of control it? Oh, for the, I, okay, for the first like six months, if we just got rich now, we hit the lottery, you, you, we buy a lot of stuff, but then our investments paid off or whatever. Yeah, yeah, stuff yeah, like exactly. They pay found, off everything. Found yeah. oil in my backyard. You know, okay, yeah, something. yeah, exactly. <laughs> Um, you know, I, I just don't think that you know, when I think when something comes easy, it's easy to not value it. Easy to get used to it. And well, yeah, and, but yeah. If, if you work really hard for something, uh -huh. you value it, yeah. right? And 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 if if someone's hit the lottery, all your friends are going to ask you, "Gosh, I really want that money. You want it? Why can't yeah. you you know kick me down ten grand for a car? Kick me? Yeah. You know, so people would definitely be asking you for money. But I don't think I think there's a lot to be learned from making your own way in life. So you think it would be bad if that guy, your best friend, uh -huh. were to give his both of his kids he has to tons of tons of millions do you yeah, think for, that would be for, really bad for no reason yeah i just i just i think what would it do to you would it make you would you work harder no i no, to be work. honest i wouldn't i'd oh i don't even know what i would do i right that's it so you wouldn't have any goals I, so your goal no. would be to what make, make it more just money make it last make the money last i yeah. don't know but i mean i, I guess it's kind of true that you got to have money to make money i mean to you, a certain degree sure yeah yeah i mean you can make little money and then eventually get the little money to medium money make the medium money to big money i mean of course right. it's way more complicated and, process than that but. and why is it why is it true that that people usually people who have a fair amount of money they actually don't aren't real free with it. You yeah, know what I mean, I they mean, can buy like, anything, okay, but they don't. Like, let's say, I, let's take an example. If I had seventy bucks, I'd spend that seventy bucks pretty fast. Okay. But if I had ten grand, I would, I wouldn't spend that ten grand very fast. You know, I buy something like for a few hundred bucks, and then I would save it because I want yeah. that. I want the thought and to know that I have ten grand. Well, because so is money like kind of security for your future, or is it just like because once? Okay, so how about this? You had ten grand. You, if you only had five grand, you go all right. When I get ten grand, I'll buy this car. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay. But once you get Makes to sense. ten grand, you go. Gosh, that's almost a down payment on a house. Yeah, that's almost fifteen grand. Which fifteen grand can buy me, you know, a, a better car. Right. So what's and so what's the mo what's what's enough money? N never, never. Honestly, well, I mean, guys, I mean, your best friend has enough, and you yeah. he knows he has enough. He gives away yeah. more than half but of it. Yeah, but it's not. It, so it turns into not be about the money anymore. Yeah. I mean, to, right? it's for, about for the, the right people. For some people, like who is that one guy who said he has multi, multi, multi millions? He's famous. Oh, it was, and he, it was Rockefeller. You, is Rockefeller. That what I'm talking I, about? I don't know who that they is. They asked him how much money. Oh, he is makes enough? like 600 million a year. I was looking at talk show hosts because I was wondering how much uh, Jimmy Fallon makes. Right. And uh, he makes like 600 million. Not Jimmy Fallon. Uh, the guy Rockefeller. Rockefeller. Well, Rockefeller's Someone. a family I, money. It's been around for a long okay, time. Okay. Yeah. Then um, is he a talk show host? No. Who, no. Am, I, who am I talking about? I, it's I, not Jay Leno. It's the one guy who's more popular than Jay Leno. Uh, I don't know. Some of you guys, comment down below. Tell me. I'd like to know. I'm too lazy to look it, it up. Is it Kimmel? No, no, no. It, it's not Fallon. Not no, Kimmel. Not no. Letterman. 
Leno. Well, could be Le- it could be Letterman. It could be Letterman. Letterman's been around forever. Okay, uh, some but, some guy makes a lot of money. Anyway, but beside but, uh, that's beside the fact. The guy I was talking about was Rockefeller. It was family money, mm-hmm. and they asked him how much money's enough because he had enough money for oh. the next five generations of his family if he wanted <laughs> yeah. to, to live perfectly or wonderfully or richly. Yeah. Um, and he said, "Oh, enough money? Yeah, it's always five thousand dollars more than I have." Yeah. So there's really no end to it. So if money's your goal, uh-huh. then you'll never reach the end of your goal. It's, yeah, so... I think you want the, the luxuries and, and peace of mind that money mm-hmm. seems to provide, but if but that's true... You're like Okay, like Justin Bieber has, I'm sure, hundreds of millions. He's got bank. Yeah, sure. he's got a lot of money. Right. And he was diagnosed with depression a few months ago. Right. That's what right. I heard. Right. How many people that are rich commit suicide? How many famous a, a rock stars? You, oh, yeah, oh yeah. a lot, a lot. Movie famous stars, rock stars, yeah. rock stars, I mean. Well, well, okay, one, one quick thing, yeah. because the gameplay is coming up a little bit, but okay. what do you think about a lot of money really fast? Uh, like, let's say you, if you went from broke to rich, if you went from yeah. making two grand a year to two million a year. Okay, here's, uh, it, which is almost like the lottery, right? Yes, okay. okay so they did a study they at, of, they, of the happiness of people who got quadriplegic mm-hmm. and compared the happiness to people who hit the lottery in the same year. At the end of a year, you know who was happier? The quadriplegic. The quadriplegic. Which is, you guys don't know what a quadriplegic is. It's someone who can't use, like, their arms, hands and arms legs. Arms and legs. All yeah. quad uh, extremities. Yeah, it's basically a, right. a terrible and, and, way okay, to Okay, so but. either they got some really optimistic quadriplegics. Yeah. Um, but I think money creates also stress. Yeah, it'd be very hard to handle a lot of money really fast. If someone just handed me $50 million, I... That'd be crazy. I couldn't handle it, to be so, honest. So what do you think people should comment here? I mean, I, you well, know, do you think it's bad for people to get rich fast? Yeah, t- tell us what you think. Do you think you should have to work for 15 years to get your million? Or should, if you could take it right now, would you take 15 seconds for a million? Ooh. Oh, oh, also, no, comment down below. Do you think you could handle a lot of money really fast? Could you handle 10 million right now and not blow it all off in two years? Okay. Could you? Tell me right now in the comment section below. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like. Make sure to tune in to, tune in to our live stream tonight, right? Please. Please. Do Twitch.tv slash QuadMFT. Link down in the description below. It's been your boy, and I'll see you guys in the next video and the live stream tonight. And I'll see you at the bank.